<sighs> well, you're our uh, PA. This yeah. is what you do. God, she just stands around and she's not even standing. That's true. She's like uh, she's like that secretary in the producers. That's why you keep her around. Right? <laughs> no, <laughs> she's like the secretary from Blazing Saddles. Oh, okay. Like the assistant in Young Frankenstein. You know, there's a pattern emerging here in Mel, <laughs> hey, Mel, Mel Brooks. Brooks movies. Yeah. <laughs> if you consider that Mel Brooks movies may not be all that original, well, that hurts me. Uh, oh, hey, welcome to Trailer Trashed. Uh, this is the show where we watch trailers, we get trashed, and we trash Mel Brooks. That hack. No, I can't say that. I love Mel Brooks. We, I'm we, so of course sorry. We do. Of course we do. But he, he would appreciate it if you know Mel Brooks as well as we do. Uh, as long as you don't ask him to be Carl Reiner. <laughs> I hate, I hate Carl, Carl Reiner. Reiner. Oh, what are we watching today? Oh, speaking of things we hate. We're... <laughs> Uh, so we're gonna watch, and there's been a lot of to do about it already. The the to Lord of, the Lord of the Rings, the uh, the Rings of Power. Um, I'm not <laughs> the search for more money. Yeah. <laughs> hey. uh, wow. Wow. Red you tying, baby. Put a fucking bow on that one. Put a one. bow we're on it. Uh, All right, we got. So they're making a stupid show because they just want to make more money. It's a prequel to Lord of the Rings, so you know I'm where it's. I'm going. done with prequels. I'm just fucking done with prequels. I blame Star Wars. They started it. I just in earnest. Anyways, I'm not excited about this. I don't really care for Lord of the Rings as much as some other people. I do. See, I like the original series, and I like two thirds of the Hobbit my, trilogy my, too. My favorite thing Lord of the Lord of the Rings related was that song Leonard Nimoy did about Bilbo Baggins. What about the stick song Lord of the Rings? Little Hobbit of the All, All hail to the Lord of the Rings. Sticks is a good just, one. Just say the thing. Let's get this over with. You, the line? Yeah. You, oh, I, you, what am I, just a little monkey? I'm gonna dance for you, and anytime you want, I'm gonna say, roll that beautiful bean footage. That counts. <laughs> you tricked me, you <laughs> monster! <laughs> it's not that difficult. <laughs> so she slightly looks like Kate Blanchett in the eyes. <laughs> so they're like, okay, you're Kate Blanchett. She's more like, oh, there's gotta be Blanchett's. There's gotta Come be on. some kind of you fucking can get pun in there. there. You can get there. Uh, Prime though. Kate. Yeah, it's Prime. I already paid for Prime, so I'm definitely gonna watch it. She's more like Kate Bland Chat. <laughs> <laughs> and it's still in New Zealand. We do have to bring more, more money to New Zealand. Elves have a forest to protect. Dwarves their mines. Men their fields mm -hmm. of grain. Men don't protect their fields of grain. They protect their fields of gold. <laughs> no, that's Sting. <laughs> oh my mistake. Which is the no, sword. sword. Bilbo uses. It's all coming together. Put a little bow on it. <laughs> Uh, what'd you Whoa. say? So they were they were doing this. You have four. Uh, I I had three. heard and I don't know. If That's it's... not Galadriel. Okay, listen. Elves don't age, right? So theoretically, once she becomes an adult, she should look the same for the, the next thousand the years. The question now is where. And yeah, but I, I I'm pretty confident she wasn't a warrior though. I mean, I guess elves. Not see what I've they're not seen. In, seen what entirely yeah. immortal, right? They just have really long. They lives. have really long lives. So I guess they would slowly age. But That's cool. Who are you gonna make the bad guy? Is this where Sauron? Is this where we're looking at Sauron the first time? Yeah, they I'm were tired of Sauron. This he's like the emperor. There was like some, there were some promo materials, but they were releasing pictures of the actor they got to play Sauron, and then were paying people online to like thirst trap over it. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Were you won? No, I took their money, but I didn't. <laughs> It's just like, no part of this seems like it was done in good faith. Well, also, Lord of Rings is fucking long enough anyway. Do I really need a TV show to watch before I start the re-extended edition? The past is dead. Good advice. The past is dead. Leave it. We don't need a prequel. Or we die with it. I mean, take your own fucking advice. This could be the beginning of a new era. Oh my god. What the? Is that a ward? What am I looking at here? The bear? The ring. Now it just sounds like Outlander. But that's not even Elvish. At least sing an Elvish. The cock rings of power. <laughs> I, I would watch that. I have watched that. Have you seen Lord of the G-Strings? So with Dildo Saggins? <laughs> <laughs> Probably better than this. Uh, um, yeah, I, I don't even know where to begin on this. Uh, I, the, just the stuff I've heard online has already poisoned me to it. 
Well, the, the thing too, there's no real basis for this. There's a, there's some stuff in the Silmarillion about it, right? I for you Tolkien care. nerds out there. I just don't care about this. I really don't. But they just made all this up as they go along. It, it's just... I hate movies that make things up as they go along. What are those called? Movies. Movies! <laughs> I hate them! I'm just done with prequels. I'm done with prequels. Prequels kill stakes, absolutely, because you know everyone's going to live. We know what's going to happen. It's um, at the same except issue. for Rogue One. Because they Whoa. introduced a whole bunch of new characters, and they killed them all. That's how you do it. Well, they did, yeah, and now they're doing an Andor TV show. Which now you know he's not gonna die. Yeah, we know, we, <laughs> so, yeah. or like when they did Kenobi. Stupid. Yeah, stinky. Stinky. Well, I, I don't wanna get into Kenobi. I don't have time, we already did it. Yeah, well, <laughs> you don't I, need to talk look, anymore. I am just trying not to talk about this fucking show because well, I, it, again, I have no it, interest in it. You have enough, is there people, are there people who need more Lord hey, of the Rings? Here, here's something, Dude. why not tell an original story of Lord of the Rings that takes place like, at, at like, Anything that's not a prequel. The extended thing is, well, I'm assuming after they kill Sauron, everyone's just happy for a million years. Or like, well, Let them talk tell, about. Tell, tell a story that takes place like tangentially or like, or just, I don't know, just there's got to be more stories than like How directly related to Tom the main characters. Tom Bombadillo series? Or just. Where's Tom Bombadillo? I just, I just don't Funny know. little willow. I don't know. <laughs> I just, I, I. I, I, I <laughs> You're flabbergasted. The man's gassed has been flabbered. <laughs> I, I, just, I don't understand it. Like, who is this show for? I mean, I'll again, I'll watch it. I don't know. I promise not to enjoy it. But I'll watch it. <laughs> I'll probably watch the first episode. The elves are hot, so I'll probably still watch it. <laughs> um, you know, even those boy elves, you know. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm not expecting anything from it. Very. Very low investment from me, but I mean, I'll watch it. I can't it, imagine it's gonna go over well with like your viewing audience. The only problem is, and the thing you gotta do, don't go, don't go retconning stuff. Oh, they Man. will. Exactly, they, they will. They, this show is gonna be like, well, they didn't fully explain it, so it gives us some wiggle room. Yeah. Now, but it's like, basically this series is what Kate Blanchett narrates in the beginning of Fellowship <laughs> of the Ring. It, Wasn't that enough? I just, yeah, and, and like I said, like some of the, the press releases and some of the, some of the stuff I've read and heard and even the, the stuff they're doing for like Entertainment Weekly and like this, like all that or whatever that they're putting out, none of it is inspiring confidence. And it seems like they're just doing what they want to do and when the fans are going to be like, we don't like it, they'll be like, it's because you're a bigot. And it's like, well, how about the fact you made well, a- Well, Derek, you are a bigot. So, I'm putting. Try, a lot I'm trying to put the big back in bigot. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, I, the other thing is, is, like they clearly made this when Game of Thrones got super popular, and or then the, it took yeah. this long to make it. Yeah, here it's super expensive. Like, They're never going to get their money. If out you of this. didn't see what happened with Game of Thrones, it didn't end well either. Yeah. yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm I'm done. No more prequels, please. Toss no more this prequels. Series into the fires <laughs> yeah. in which it was forged. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> Right? Yeah. Anyway, uh, let's get out of here. Uh, that's all from Trailer Trash. We'll see you, sons of bitches. No more sun. prequels. <laughs>